Hello everybody, welcome back to the series. Next up in the guide, we'll be taking a look at two of the game's secret stars. This is going to be Princess Peach's Secret Slide 1 and 2. If you've been following along on the playlist, you're probably wondering why we're taking care of some of the earliest stars in the game here at the end of the playlist. And I don't really have much of an excuse for that. Part of the way through uh, recording all this footage, I kind of decided I wanted to have all the secret stars in one section at the end, but I had already done some of them and I didn't want to re-record it, so don't worry about it, I'm not stressing about it. In any case, here we go with Peach's Slide now. You may have guessed by the name of the video, but there is actually two stars to collect here in Peach's Slide. This footage here is just me collecting the easier of the two, and then we'll focus on the second one afterwards. This one, all you gotta do is just get down to the bottom of the slide, that's it. Just don't fall off and you'll be collecting the star no problem. The next time we come down the slide, we have to finish the slide, cross the finish line within 21 seconds, and another star appears. It's probably, in my opinion, one of the more well-hidden stars in the game. I mean, there is a sign at the top of the slide that does sort of explain it to you, but I think it's worded a little bit weird, but that's not important. In any case, that was the easier of the two stars. No problem there. Now, going up and starting this all over again, uh, the only thing I think to really keep in mind here is that you definitely need to be pushing forward on the control stick. It does make you go down the slide faster, uh, but you don't want to be pushing forward on the control stick the entire time. Try to watch me uh, here in this footage. I do pull back on the stick to kind of take corners a little bit sharper. So I'm holding forward pretty much this entire time. All of this, I may pull back a little bit here. Nope, nope, still forward, still forward. But on these turns right here, I do definitely pull back on the stick, and I think that's important. If you go, if you if you hold forward throughout that entire S-curve section, I think you'll hit the walls and you'll lose speed. So there you go. Just barely uh, half a second remaining there, so the timing is pretty tight on it. So that may be something that you have to try a couple of times. But like I said, just focus on being on the control stick. It's probably better to uh, go down too fast, be on the control stick too much, and, and make those mistakes of bumping into things or not making the corners fast enough. And, th and that way you can kind of dial it back little by little until you just barely make it around those corners. And then uh, I think you'll collect that one no problem. In any case, that's how I collect those stars. Thank you so much for checking out the series, and I'll see you in the next one.